guys and welcome back to my channel so i'm so oh my gosh this is just gonna be the hugest thrift store haul ever like seriously once a year i do go to the thrift store and i splurge like i spend like 200 dollars in hi. the thrift store hi how you doing hey how you doing oh. i love it they can't see you right there come back i also bought ash some toys he has like two big bags of toys, three big bags of toys or something like that. But anyways, I gotta talk to people. Okay. I'll see you later. Bye. We'll all see you later, okay? okay? We know what you're doing. We know you're playing with your trains, okay? So, once a year, I splurge about $200 at the thrift store and I just go crazy. I go nuts because summer is coming up. If you hear a motorcycle or anything in the background, that's my next door neighbor. But they... Like, literally, I bought all my summer stuff at the thrift store, and I just love, 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 love meeting new people, and I've met some subscribers, and I met some people that want to subscribe to my channel, so if you saw me at the thrift store today, hello, hi, how you doing? Thank you for subscribing to my YouTube channel, and yes, we are going to get into this haul. Like, I'm not even going to edit this video today. You guys, definitely go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Press it. Smash it. Smack the shit out of it, okay? And then also go ahead and subscribe to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I'm Andrea Michelle. I have a lot of energy, just like my little kiddo, Ashton, which is six. I'm a single mom in Texas. Dallas, Texas, it is, y'all. Hey. Uh, so, um, basically... I do a lot on this channel. It's not going to be like about hauls. It's not going to be about like cooking and stuff like that. It's going to be a lot, whole lot more on this channel, you guys. So this channel is about to change. And I'm really excited for the new change for my channel. But yeah, yeah, you guys. Let's get into the haul because I want to share how bad I've been wanting an Instapot at my house. I've been wanting one so bad. I'm tired of seeing all the YouTubers with the Instapots and getting on here saying, well, this Instapot does this and this does that. But girl, I'm a single mom. I didn't have a hundred and some dollars for that Instapot. So I went to the thrift store. Guess what I found today? I walked around the corner and I found, it ain't an Insta, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, one of them Instapots, but it's not the actual Instapot. This is Aroma. That's what it is. But it is so freaking huge, you guys. Like, and don't worry, everything that you see housewise is always definitely gonna be sanitized and clean with a little bit of bleach, a little bit of soap, and a little bit of um sanitizer my mom makes. So um I clean everything, I deep clean everything. So don't worry, like we're just gonna really eat. No, no, no. Girl, I gotta wash all this because it got like writing on here and stuff. So the Instapots are like $139. And some of them I saw they were like 79, but I bought this for only 12.81. Okay, and they said this is okay, and I actually plugged it in the wall at the thrift store, and I mean literally on instant it was heating up. Everything works really good. So yeah, let me show you the inside of it. So it's like a huge, a huge pot. <laughs> so I could put anything in there, like. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I found one of these. I'm really happy. I'm really excited about it. Um, let me put this over here. Then I found like some other stuff. Like I found this little bucket that I could put um, downstairs in my um, living room. And I love this. Like on instant walking in the door, somebody sees like blessed. You know, like for people to put their shoes in this. Like I don't care. Like I want them to put their shoes in this. I don't like like because I have um, like like grayish carpet whitish grayish carpet so um when you walk on it and it's dirty outside or whatever um it automatically gets dirty and i do have a shampoo a carpet shampoo but it takes so much time to get all that stuff out of the out of the um the carpet that it just like for me like it wastes time but i do deep clean my carpet like once a month um, but yeah, when people come in, I would just like tell them to put their shoes in here or I'll just get like a little sign that says, please put your shoes in there. Um, so yeah. Um, and then I got this little cute little birdhouse thing. I don't know. Let me see if you guys can see it like this. Yeah, it's kind of like a little birdhouse thing. 
um, and then the door opens. You could put like a flower in there. That's what I plan on doing is just putting flower in there. Um, by any means necessary, I'm not trying to be a, a flower mom or anything like that, but it's going to be an artificial flower that I'm going to put in this. So, yeah. <laughs> um, I found these little houses, these little cute houses, and this lady, she was looking, I was just like, that is so cute. I didn't see it when I came in. I should have came over here. Normally, when she goes in the thrift store, she normally goes to that same section, and she said today she wanted to switch up her route or whatever. So, I went that way today. I never go that way, and then I saw this, these houses. Oh, my. <laughs> these are so cute, and I didn't know that they lit up. Like, they lit up. Um, you can turn it, like, on or off. But they're like little house ladderings or something like that. But these are so cute. And you would think like for Christmas and stuff. But no, I still have my Christmas ones that I got from Target. Um, but I still use them in the house. And people are like, it don't even look really Christmassy or whatever. But yeah, I got, I got not one, not two, but three of these bad boys <laughs> so yeah i was really excited to find them and then i asked the lady if they have any more definitely put them aside for me i'll come and get them because i really like these and they also help with like if you have kids and they're scared to go to the bathroom by themselves put this inside of the bathroom light them up and i'm sure they're going to be fine a-okay um because that gives out a lot of light um and then i bought this set here it's like an espresso cup set or whatever. And basically you just, if you have like scones or something like that. Because I've been wanting to make like scones and I've been wanting to make like um, little breakfast dishes and stuff. So if you wanted like some fruit or something, you can have your little espresso cup there. And then put your fruit in there. And then this whole set costs $1.99. So with the two espresso cups and then this... It costs about nine nine. Um, this is from Pier One, you guys. So the whole set is from Pier One, um, and you know they stuff is just really expensive. And I really don't go into Pier One unless I really, really need like something. But yeah, so I can't wait to use these. Uh, I'm gonna put those in the sink because after this I'll be washing everything. Then I found like a little pan here that I can make like uh omelet egg with not omelet but like a, just a circle egg. Um, to fit my sandwich and when I was looking at the back of it it says something like uh ribeye war um and it says copper clay and it says 1801 so I'm wondering if this is like a antique I don't know but somebody already used it but I wonder if this pan is antique because 1801 is so way back um but yeah I got um this little pan just for like egg um, fry like egg in it or scrambled eggs um, and then I got some of these uh, plates they were from Pottery Born so in the summertime I like to um, host summer events on my balcony so these will be really great because they have like the little hole for like you just put your like kind of put your hand through here I don't know how that will work though but it you just put your hand through it like just like something like that and you just carry one hand of your plate and you can eat and then you can just talk or whatever so yeah that's what that little hole is for and y'all <laughs> I went up in there and I had got like they had this target clear um, platter tray thing and it was really really cute it was like a little bump bumpy little things whatever um, and I was gonna have that for one of my hosting for one of my summer balcony event things and my son well actually it was my fault as I think about it right now I had the platter sitting like kind of towards the back of the cart and when my son uh bumped into the cart it just like kind of flew out the cart and it broke and it cut me on my hand right here I'm good it hit my feet and now my toe is like a little bit swollen but I was really like Y'all, if y'all ever went to the store and got something and y'all kids made the mistake and just accidentally made you drop your stuff and you just feel like, oh my gosh, that was like the last one. It was like one in a million and I really wanted it. That's how I felt. Like, I was just like so angry, so mad, but I was cool, calm, and collect and I don't understand like, like, man, you know, but I didn't let my son see it and I was just like, the whole time I was like, I really wanted that platter. 
I really wanted that plan. And he was like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But um, either way it goes, I love my kiddo. And it was an accident. It was actually my fault. And I can admit it. I could be mama enough to say, hey, I put that there. And like now I'm feeling great. I'm all right because I see all this stuff. And I was like, well, maybe I really didn't <laughs> need it, you know, because I got a lot of stuff to show y'all. So let's keep going. I got this little um, glass thing here. I thought it was really cute to put like some bath salts or maybe some um, like bath um, soap inside of it. It didn't come with a top, but I have a cork at home that I can cork it off with. So yeah, this was only like $1.91. My whole total for everything that I'm showing you today was only $140. So I still have a little bit of money left to spend if I wanted to. But I think I'm done <laughs> just for now. Um, and then I got some 12 Twilight Fresh Cut Grass Lemon uh, Juicy Watermelon. Uh, contains essential oils. And this is from um, Target, you guys. Uh, Target, was, it was on clearance for $3.48 and only paid $1.94. So this is what that looks like. And, yeah. All kinds of juiciness up in there and then so what is that oh i don't know what that is it's like a race car it is a race car but you can't put it on the floor and race it that's like a pillow uh one of those pillow race cars and so i did get one um some ikea stuff and i'm not sure what this is i might go on ikea and see what it is but i'm not sure what this is i don't know if it's like a glass that you drink out of um or you put flowers in it. I don't know what you do with it. Or maybe it's a measuring cup. I don't know what you do with it. But I'm going to go on Ikea later today. and Or I may go to Ikea and see what this is all about. But I only paid $2.92 for it. Um, and this is what it looks like. This is What do you guys think? What do you think this is? Like I don't know what it is. What could it be? Like a measuring cup or something? But it doesn't have like the measuring um, numbers on it but I bought two of those mom said there were cups um, but I think they're like measuring I don't know um, and then I bought these cute candle holders like I don't these are so cute and made differently from all the candle holders I've seen these are so freaking cute I don't know where they came from they don't have like anything on them it says they made in India but I paid like $2.99 for one and $3.99 for the other one. Um, so, yeah. This thrift store I always tell you guys about. It's called um, Thrift Giant on Garland Road in Dallas, Texas. So, if you're in the Dallas area or if you're in the Garland area and you um, see it, it's, I don't know, I think it's like Oats or something. Like, this, the crossway would be Oats and Garland. So, yeah. Um, next thing that I bought were... Just some clothes. Yeah, just some clothes from me, uh, me and Ashton. So I bought this nice um, top here. I'm gonna wear. It. I'm gonna pair this with like some skinny jeans or some loose leg jeans. And you guys, this is so freaking cute. Like I feel like you can wear it different ways. Um, so look at the front. It's like kind of like it has those little ties up there. You can. I'm not trying to show all my cleavages, but that is so freaking cute. Mama, like, I'm a mama, but I want to be sexy during the summer. But, so, I feel like you can wear it both ways. This right here, this part right here is supposed to go in the back. Like, something like that in the back. But I feel like you can definitely, definitely wear it either or. Front or back. <laughs> you can get away with it. So, yeah, I bought that. I bought cute outfits, you guys. Like, I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling sexy. I want, I want to just look so cute during the summer. I love summer. So, I got another one. And it's just their little romper. And this is like a red wine romper. And it has like little ruffles at the, the ends of the romper. Like that. Really cute. And then, in the front, it just looks like normal but the back honey girl yes you got to get that back together it has like a little crisscross thing going on here where you can see just a little bit of the the back 
and I feel like I don't know you probably can't wear that this like that but um it's really cute I like it every all the clothes that you see will be washed um and I really need to get an urn I don't like to earn but I know I need to start earning um so I got this other top it's kind of springish really cute I love it this is the flowers on it. It's really cute. It feels nice and soft. And then it has like, I love, like I've been into ruffles lately. So this one has like two of the ruffles. So it's kind of like that. Also, I got, I found a dress. I hope you guys can be able to see this one, but this is kind of like a cute, one of those cute summery dresses. So it looks like that. It's really long, you guys, but it's going to fit. It's going to be really cute. And then the top is like sort of like this. I was trying to figure out before I um, before I had showed you guys this, how I was going to like show you guys because I'm really kind of quite lost on it. But this is how it looks right here. So the next item that I have is this dress. It's just two top dress. More for like putting over your swimsuit, your bikini, or your two-piece, one-piece, whatever. Um, and it's going to be for summer as well. It's quite long. I'm 5'5", five five, so it'll work. And it's just like kind of like this thing. So, yeah. It's cute. Then I bought a couple of shirts. And I think I bought some more dresses too. So I bought this shirt here. I just love, love this pattern. Um, I want, I was looking for me some um, like um, summertime cowgirl boot kind of sort of like open toe, open back. So I can wear this with, look at that. I love this shirt. Um, I'm going to uh, wear this with some, some skinny jeans, this top, and some cowgirl open toe open toe back bottom booty boots and that's the way it looks in the back the button i mean it's really cute and you don't have to worry about being like freaking hot because it has like little holes in it so yeah i really like it and then just check out the inside detailing of it it's really cute so yeah i got that um another thing i got was this dress, this is more for, you can wear this out or whatever, but me personally, it's gonna, I'm gonna make it out of a, a nighttime gown. Um, but yeah, I really like it. It's cute for summer. Um, and yeah, I think it's from H&M. So yeah, I think it's a dress, but I'm gonna probably make it out of a nightgown. <laughs> um, Cause it's really big, it's like an extra large, so. But this one right here is from Gap, H&M. Yeah, H&M. And the tag is still on. This was retail price at $14.99, but I only paid $8.99 for it. But it's really cute. Just something simple for summer. Little short dress, body kind of dress. Really cute. And then I found this sexy, oh my gosh, it's so sexy. This sexy wraparound dress from Target. This retails at $24.99, but I got it at the thrift store for $9.99. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Just look at the arm on it. It's just so cute. Um, so yeah, just a black, simple, cute dress. Short, sexy. Um, I'm probably going to go in the summer. I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff. So I'm probably going to go like downtown Dallas so you guys can see what it looks like down there and stuff like that. I did pick up some handbags that I thought was oh so cute. Oh my gosh, you guys. The first one here, this is the first little handbag that I got. And all of these handbags did not come with their own straps, which is okay because um, I have extra straps at home that I can put on them and I'll match just right. I mean, well... I'm really happy that it's print. The prints are like snake skin prints. If you can see, it's like snake uh, snake prints. I'm not into all them prints and stuff and animal and all that stuff. But this is really cute. 
Um, I'm really glad that it's fake snake. So you just open it like that. And then I hope, well, you open it like that. And then this is what it looks like in there. Just something simple. This is by the brand Icing. I've never heard of it. And it's got a lot of space in there. So, yeah. And this is what it looks like. That's a little purse detail thing right there. So, that's the first bag that I got. And then I got another one. Was from Oh, this bag was $6.54 or $0.59. Cents. And this bag came from Target. This is just the normal little, you know, backpack. If you don't want to be like, you know, holding stuff or whatever. You can just carry a little backpack or whatever. I'm one of those moms, like I want to go mom and I work, you know, stuff like that. So this can be like my work bag. Um, and you just kind of lift it up. And this also has like a lot of room in it. Like I said, this came from Target. And it's a lot of room in that bag. So yeah. Um, and then this bag right here. I was just like, oh my gosh, this is really cute. Um, it's kind of remind me of this one kind of of like. Um, and then at home, I do have like a big old armoire thing where I put my bags and stuff in, whether it's fake or real. Um, I have not ever invested in a Louis Vuitton or a St. Lawrence or anything like that. I really want a St. Lawrence bag. And maybe next year I'll invest in a St. Lawrence bag but until then i'll just stick with my little bougie bags <laughs> um this bag is from torrid and i love that color in the inside it's like a baby pink sort of um but yeah i love this bag this is really cute you can wear it like this or on your shoulder but me personally i just love to wear my bags you know kind of like that so yeah i got those three bags but out of all the three bags, I'm not going to lie, this is my favorite because it looks so cute. And it looks like, girl, is she balling on the budget? She's somebody's mama balling, okay? <laughs> um, and then I got like one, two, three, three. These are all for my glasses collection. Uh, four, five, six pairs of glasses. I'm not going to put them on my face because I haven't washed them. But the first ones look like this. And then just regular, but they're really cute. The second ones are my, my favorite of all time. It's just this regular circle glasses. And then I got to like some wood type glasses. This is kind of broke, so I'm going to be careful. I'm going to do what I'm going to do is just put some nail glue down. Because see, look, you guys. <laughs> I'm going to put some nail glue down and glue it in place. So, it'll stay like this for a little bit. For me, personally, I don't wear, like, glasses a lot until summertime. Um, I, when I saw these, I fell in love. These are my fave. Rose gold, kind of, like, really cute. These are really cute, too, as well. Can't wait till I wash every one of them. And then we're going to have, like, a little haul, a little glasses try-on type of haul. And I got these. These are really cute. These are trimmed in gold. So, yeah, I got six of those. Next is going to be Ashton's. Well, it's going to be the shoes that I bought myself. Um, just some champions. These are champions from uh, Walmart. So, I just bought some of these. These are really nice. Nothing wrong with them. Just regular shoes. Those are more for my walking. Um, and then now we're going to get into Asia J's um, clothing haul. My son, he's six, so I um, got him a Jordan shirt and authentic Jordan shirt. Very new. So, yeah, got him one of those. <clears throat> and then I got him a Old Navy top when we go walking and stuff like that. He can be cool. Also got myself a workout top, and it looks like this. It's a regular top. And then I like the back because look, guys, it has like this flower thing on the back. Really cute. 
and then it has like all those different kind of mesh so that you can get a lot of air and the brand is called i'm not sure um mpg like i've never heard of that but if you know what that is let me know and i got a couple shirts all this stuff is brand spanking new it says roll what roll with it shirt and this is from old navy as well old navy definitely donates to the um Old Navy definitely donates to Goodwill a lot. And I got him some shorts. These are Old Navy as well. Then I got him another shirt here, which is Old Navy. And it says Aloha. And then I got him some shorts, which is from Circo. These shorts. So that's why I meant by I really need to get a urn so I can start earning his clothes. And it looks like that on the back. Um, I really love this for little like little boys, like my son, anyways, because he he's really slow when it comes to like bathroom wise. Now he gets it and he knows how to unbuckle pants in his shorts, blue jean shorts. But sometimes he forgets and it's like, oh my goodness, he makes accidents, you know. Um, but with those, I love the stretchy. Um, the stretchy shorts because um, he can get out of them really quick. So the last couple of things that I got were these baskets here. Oh boy. <laughs> these baskets. So I got all these baskets um, from the thrift store and they came from Ikea. So all the baskets were donated by Ikea and I'm so happy that I went today and I was able to grab some stuff like all this stuff is some good quality stuff and I just cannot wait to just oh, wear it, use it and yeah, de decorate with most everything. And then also for free, um, <laughs> she put all my stuff in this huge um, Ikea bag here. So whenever I go to Ikea, I can definitely use this bag over. Um, she asked me if I want another one, but I told her no. But she definitely fit everything that I bought in the Ikea bag. And I was just like, you are so amazing. Um, so <laughs> anyways, you guys, that's the end of our haul. I'm sure that's it. Yeah, that's the end of our haul. And thank you guys for coming to my channel. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that thumbs up. Smash it smash 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 and then thank you if you made it this far thank you for watching hold on thank you for watching our channel uh and yes thank you so much so, so much and we'll definitely be back tomorrow which one is tomorrow friday saturday we may not be back tomorrow but we may be back oh yeah we, we may be back tomorrow if not tomorrow then monday because we are taking the weekend off and we're just gonna chill whatever so yeah and you too, family. Are you going to give us a thumbs up? Are you just going to subscribe? Do it right now. And smash so, it. Smash, 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 smash. And don't, smash, and don't smash it. And don't subscribe to the channel. Bye.